We have these four guys here wearing four different costumes. The first one is wearing a raincoat, OK? It's been raining, there's some rain, it's wet. So he's got rubber boots on. Number two is actually a nude man. It's, we couldn't Ooh. have a nude person standing there. I've been there, done that, the golf course. <laughs> I just want to talk about yeah. uh, Number three here. Uh, this guy here is wearing, obviously, a suit of armour. Right. The last one here is Mr Rubber Man. <laughs> Only one dummy will survive the Tesla's million volt spark. This is super, super, super dangerous. If you think about what comes out of a socket in your house, you've got 110 volts. This is 9,000 times more Whoa. voltage. That's a massive amount of electricity. Wow. Fire it up! That's Fire it up! Yeah. Let's go. OK, let's do this. In three. In two. You guys ready? Yeah. Let's do it. And in one. Hit it! <laughs> the rain jacket and rubber boots are toast. Whoa! The lightning absolutely obliterates the naked guy. The suit of armour and the rubber wetsuit are left. <laughs> the rubber wetsuit goes up in flames. Oh, wow. We have a winner. Oh. Yes, I knew it, I knew it, I knew well it. Well done. I told you guys. Did you hear that? Yes. That was unreal. Oh, I felt that. Oh, that was oh, awesome. Geez. Look at the state of this. Oh, what's not this? The but wow. we have one left standing. It's not hot. So why is this one the winner? Because I'm smarter than everybody else. <laughs> I, don't know. I don't think that's the truth. <laughs> the truth is, electricity seeks the easiest path from point A to point B or in this case, from the dummy to the ground. And the metal in the armour provides the easiest path. The armour forms a continuous barrier around the dummy, keeping the charge on the outside of the suit so it never touches the dummy and instead passes undisrupted to the ground. So inside, untouched. Right. Isn't that amazing? I believe it. If it were just a metal hat you were wearing, you'd be toast. <laughs>